Terry Sagan here with LaSalle Police Service. Today we're here to talk about grooming. Opening up a conversation about this important topic is an important act of prevention. If adults can understand the signs of grooming, we can better identify, stop it, and prevent it. Let's start with the basics. What is grooming? Grooming is a process where an offender builds trust with the child and or their family. Once an emotional connection is established, the offender moves the relationship with the child into a space that's unsafe, inappropriate, and exploitative. Grooming a child may look like targeting a child or youth, gaining trust, filling a need, isolation, sexualizing the relationship, maintaining control. Did you know the offender is most likely someone that the child already knows and trusts, such as a community member, coach, teacher, relative, peer, or family friend. It's also important to look for signs of grooming online, given the fact that our children are spending increasing amounts of time on their computers and phones and online, it's important for us that we understand the pressures that our children face while online and how difficult it can be to define safe boundaries. It's important to trust your instincts. If a relationship between an adult and a child feels inappropriate, uncomfortable, or weird, speak up. If you'd like to learn more about grooming, be sure to reach out to an advocate at the Windsor-Essex Child and Youth Advocacy Center. Our number is 519-995-3974. Always call 911 if there's an emergency. If you suspect that a child is being harmed or is at risk of being harmed, contact the Essex County Children's Aid Society at 519-252-1171.